and I wasn't going to share this with you guys because I don't like people in my business but I'm not gonna lie to y'all I've just been going through it it has not been easy it is hard the nigga that I thought that we was here trying me thinking we got an open door policy I'm not going for that I actually met somebody Right before this happened, I found myself in a very vulnerable situation. And my friends had to kind of like, what's not clicking, Tasia? <laughs> what's not clicking? Hey, y'all. It's your girl, Tasia. If you're new here, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. Please make sure you subscribe and turn on the post notifications so you never miss another upload video. I upload beauty, lifestyle, entrepreneurship, and college content. So... On today's video, I'm just gonna be, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna break y'all in. The, the inside scoop of what's been going on. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I've just been going through it. Y'all know I broke my foot a couple weeks ago. I broke my left foot. Things have been hard. I've been out of work. Um, I haven't been able to make no money. Y'all know I do overeats. That's not even an option with my foot and hopping around. That wasn't an option. So, bills still gotta get paid. Right now, I only have um, car note, car insurance, and then like some little other stuff that I might pay for. But my bills are expensive. My car note is almost $500. My insurance um, is like $400 something. dollars. So, it's been hard. And like I said in the other video, that's really what was bothering me. I don't do the not having money thing. That, that's something that really. It made me feel some type of way. That'll put me in the mood. I don't want to talk. I don't want to eat. I don't want to be around nobody. I got an attitude. I don't. I don't like being down bad. I don't like. I don't like any of it. But who does? Who who just likes to have financial issues? Nothing fun, and I don't like it. And especially when I don't have no control over it. It ain't like I'm just being lazy. But I really, I can't do anything. I haven't been able to do anything. So that's been bothering me. Just adjusting. Period not putting pressure on my foot i've been walking for 20 years i've never broken a bone so we about to fall it's hard getting out in and out of the tub it's hard doing simple things i be windy those type of things it's just so it's emotional it's been emotional it's been an adjustment my mom bought me a scooter that's helped but the scooter is not good in the house in confined areas it's more when i go out and then i don't want to be seen only when i go out i had actually met somebody Right before this happened, and I found myself in a very vulnerable situation, and my friends had to kind of like, what's not clicking, Tasia? <laughs> what's not clicking? And so, had to snap up out of that, because, you know, niggas like to take advantage. Then, this other nigga that I thought, you know, we, we had, we was here, he tried me. Like, thinking we got an open door policy. I'm not going for that either. So, it's just, <laughs> it's just been stuff that's going on. Folks been showing their true colors when it comes to me. But my folks have been down. And so, like, it's just been, it, everybody been showing their true colors. Everybody around me. Followers, everybody, my church family, everybody, like, I'm seeing everything for what it is for real. When people say that hard times bring out the real in people, that is so real. And I've been experiencing it firsthand. I can honestly say that I've I've been finding myself and it ain't been what I think it's been like three weeks and um, my sister was telling me this is a good thing like you need to sit down and journaling brainstorming pulling out creative stuff in me stuff that I didn't skills that I didn't even know that I had which reminds me well I recently launched a new business it's a flyer business well it's a I'll take that back. It's a marketing business. I'm starting with flyers and it's going to go up. I'm going to eventually offer logos, business cards. I'm going to do web design because I actually designed a website for my church. So skills like that that I didn't even, like that I haven't even tapped into. I've been tapping into. I've been focusing on myself really through this process. Like it's really like gotten me like here. You know, it's really, it's gotten me to a place to where I can Figure some things out about myself and really find myself. And I'm so grateful for it. So, when I broke my foot, I had only been on my new job for two weeks. It was an assisted living facility job. I had only been on the job for two weeks. I did not like it. It was very messy. See, I wasn't getting paid what I should have what I should have been getting paid because I am certified. I was getting paid what people weren't certified was getting paid. And I was like, mm -mm. So, I didn't like it anyway. And I needed an exit anyway. So with this, I was able to come off of that job. In the process, land two 
different jobs. I'm going to be a supervisor with one company and then another company I'm going to be a CNA as well. You know, I always want to keep my skills up. I'm so grateful and I'm so thankful for the opportunities and the way that I just, the way that they just, just came. Like, I'm going to tell y'all about it. Once I get locked in for it, I'm going to tell y'all how God just, like, literally just, 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 just like that. So he's been good. He's been really good to me. Like I mentioned, my, my parents have been helping me with my bills. My friends have been helping me eat with gas money, anything that I really need. They, they've been there for me. And it's hard. Very humbling because I don't like asking nobody for nothing. I don't like nobody doing anything for me. I don't like being in this position. So it's been humbling. Just like last year around this time when I didn't have my car for five months. And I had to depend on my sister. Back then, I was doing YouTube, trying to find myself again. I've grown more, and I'm back in that same place. Like, okay, it's time to find yourself even more. It's time to figure out even more stuff about yourself. And I'm grateful for it because I always know that good things take time, and it get hard before it get good. So I just been running towards it. When it happened, I was like, why me? Like, why why me, God? Like, I, I just started this job two weeks ago. Like, I'm I'm trying to get myself right. Like, why 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 now? Like, why me? Like. And it's like, why not you? Like, why why not you? You you made for this, you built for this, you strong. Don't run away from this struggle. Don't run away from things that you're going through. Run towards it. Not having pity parties and this and why this and being emotion. Being in my emotions, because emotions don't make money at the end of the day. Like being in my emotions, sitting there crying, all that, like it don't make me no money. Yes, it's okay. So, you know, express myself and get that out, but it's you gotta get up and go at the same time. After you get that out, I've just been looking at it all differently. Like, yes, I'm in a situation, but now I figured out more ways to make me some money. I figured out more things about myself. I figured out more skills that I have. Like, I'm finding my worth, okay? <laughs> I've been finding my worth, and it's just like so, it's overwhelming. It's overwhelming. But the devil meant to be bad has been turning out for my good, and I'm just grateful, y'all. Like, I'm just so grateful like it's just been a whole process and it's it's amazing like i can't lie to y'all and i wasn't going to share this with you guys because i don't like people in my business i don't like people feeling like they got the up on me but i'm growing a platform i'm i, I want to be an influencer i well i am an influencer i'm an influencer i may not influence how many people other people influence but i do influence already i'm an influencer i'm an upcoming influencer like i have a platform that i'm trying to build. i have a brand that i'm trying to build and if i can't be transparent then it's not really it, it's really no it's really no point like i tell y'all on free game friday on my free game friday videos the whole point of free game fridays is to be transparent with y'all and have somebody that y'all can relate to so i'm like why are you trying to keep this from them this that don't make sense don't don't like let them in let them know what's going on let them know that even if they have stuff going on that they're not the only ones going through this and that y'all in this together like i be saying we in this together so here i am um just wanted to i just wanted to let you guys know give you guys a little a little insight of what's been going on with me because it's not easy it has not been easy it is hard it is a fight for real for real but the people around me well, God first has been so good because he placed them in my life. God has been good. The people around me have been good. And I'm grateful. If you like this video, if you like any of my other videos, please make sure you leave a really big thumbs up. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button to turn on the notifications so you never miss when I upload a video. And yes, that's all I have for you guys today. I thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you back on my next video. Bye.